Hi, I'm Kathy Kelly for Red Carpet Report, and we are here at the Television Academy for the premiere of Showrunners to talk to some of the creators of your favorite television shows. I mean, you've worked on so many that you wish had gotten to go longer. Well, I mean, Men of a Certain Age is the one that's in the movie they really follow. Um, so that was very near and dear to my heart. I, I've been fortunate. I've never... I know there are people with experiences where they're like, I wouldn't care if this show got canceled that I'm working on. Like, I wouldn't really mind. I have never had that experience. Um, I've been very fortunate that way. Um, but certainly men of a certain age which is featured in the you know, so, um, That's actually the journey to follow is kind of, um, let's just say my heartbreaking. <laughs> How did you get involved with this whole process? They came, I, 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 there was a writer, I think Sean Hader, who writes for Orange is the New Black now. Uh, I believe she had a connection to the filmmakers and said they're making a documentary and they want to come in the writer's room. And it was, it was right at the end of Men of a Certain Age. Um, and, you know, we didn't know it was going to turn into this whole thing. They were just starting to film. So I probably said some stuff I never would have said if I had any idea there'd be a red carpet. Um, and you've had a really successful career. Is there anyone else that's a peer of yours who's also a showrunner that you kind of look up to? Well, certainly Phil Rosenthal, who created a Everybody Loves Raymond. Um, I had a very false sense of security of going. I just started on a hit show. That was my first job, and then I was there for six years. And I just thought, oh, this is the way it is. That's the way it is. And then I quickly found out, no, it's, that's almost never the way it is. Um, but he was a great guy amazingly talented man to learn from so I feel like I got into this business with like learning the right things from someone who was doing it really well. There's so many great TV shows on right now what are some of your other favorite shows? Oh well you know I'm a big Parks and Rec guy, uh, Brooklyn Nine-Nine I love, um, you know we're watching The Americans we just we're now watching Transparent which is fantastic, Orange is New Black, tremendous. Um, Parenthood, big favorite of ours. You know, I say ours, me and my wife, you know. Um, I, I thought Fargo was amazing. Um, so, yeah, that's some. That's, um. <laughs> um, you mentioned Orange is the New Black. Is an online streaming service something that you ever thought, like, creating a show specifically for? Oh, of course, yeah. It's, it's great what, where they're, how they're opening everything up. And because of the way the, everything's being fragmented, you don't need a hundred billion people to watch it and it still becomes, you know, it becomes part of the conversation and it, it's, every, every network or streaming service has their own needs. So it really can open up what you can do on screen. Well, thank you so much for talking to us. Enjoy tonight. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, click like, make sure to subscribe to our channel and leave us a comment below letting us know what your favorite TV show is.